Start by clicking New Device Setup. On New Device Setup screen, click Setup Device in the upper right hand corner. The device's internet will be the first setup screen. On this page you will see Wi-Fi where you input the SSID of your Wi-Fi connection. Wi-Fi security mode which is open or personal. Ethernet where you select the network connectivity if you're using an Ethernet cradle port. And proxy where you can select manual or none. In this example, we are only inputting the Wi-Fi SSID. Click Next. This brings us to the Zebra Services screen. At present we have lifeguard over the air as the only option on this screen. It is selected by default. If you do not want to use lifeguard over the air for this device you can click to unselect. Click next. We are now on the basic properties screen. On this screen we have device setup name, device setup description, and device group association. For this example we create a device setup name of training setup. We also create a device setup description called training device setup. we add a device group called training. Once we type in the new device group name, we click add group to add it to the group association list. Now we select the group association we created from the list and click next. We are now on the review screen where we can review our selections and if need be click on edit to go back to the appropriate screens to edit our previous selections. If the settings are correct, click next. Finally, we arrive at the barcode page where our stage now barcode will be created that we will use to stage our device. Click Done. We now return to the new device setup page. The pop-up lets us know we can easily click on View Barcode to see our staging barcode again.